Banak. My poet, laureate, how are you getting along? Very well, your highness. I thank you for your kindness. You're such a great man, and I'm your biggest fan. <laughs> I love having a poet laureate. It's so much fun in conversation. What brings you near? Have no fear. Be of good cheer, for good news I bring. I wish to sell you this thing. Uh, uh, this is not a thing. This is a slave girl. Uh, yes, but girl doesn't rhyme. I can't find a rhyme all the time. Why do you want to sell this slave girl to me? Okay, listen. She's a Christian. This is not so bad. Not as good as being a druid, but we have many Christians here in Ireland. She has a trait. It's one I hate. And what is that? She likes to give to all who ask, and she gives and gives, but never gets back. Well, that seems not so bad. What's the price? Twenty silver coins, a goat, two sheep. Uh, is that price too steep? Too steep indeed. Ten coins. Shh, alas, a homeless man's about to pass. Uh, let us wait, and when he leaves, we'll negotiate. Help me. Your royal highness, have pity on me. I need food and shelter for my family. Please, please help. Do go away, you dirty scoundrel. Oh, good lord, she stole your sword. Yes, my lord, I stole your sword. So that beggar could afford to pay his family's room and board. You're a poet? I, I didn't know it. No, I'm a Christian woman of honest sense who gives to the poor at every chance. I turned your sword of violence into a sword of righteousness. <laughs> well, I'm quite impressed. I don't think I want you near my stuff, but I'm quite impressed all the same. Dubak. You must give her her freedom. Do not sell her as a slave. Let her go. Let her go? Let her go. Set her free, and we shall see. Perhaps St. Bridget uh, she will be.